Take a deep breath. This, this is actually going to happen. Everyone made it. Everyone can be seated. On behalf of the families, we want to welcome you and thank you for joining us today as witnesses to this special event as Frank and Allie commit their love to one another for the rest of their lives. Today is about Frank and Allie. We, we do want to celebrate their love, but just as importantly, more importantly, Today is about God and His love, the love that He has for us, and so we want to celebrate the love that He has for us in the person of Jesus Christ. Christians believe that a wedding, and even what takes place after this, the feasting and the celebrating, is a shadow pointing us to a future celebration, to a future feast when we as God's people dwell with God forever and enter into His presence. Frank and Allie, in your marriage, you live in that shadow, waiting for that future joy, even as you enjoy each other's lives in the days to come. So we want to celebrate Jesus and make much of him even while we celebrate your love. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? Her mother and I.
So this brings us to the point where before God and these witnesses, you're gonna take vows of commitment to one another. In the Bible, when God makes a promise or a covenant, he gave a sign or a symbol that was to be a reminder of his covenant love. One of the symbols that Frank and Allie will exchange as a symbol of their love and devotion is a wedding ring. So at this point, you need to get the rings. You can turn. All right, Allie, we're gonna start with you. If you would take Frank's hand. All right, Allie, repeat after me. I, Allie, take you, Frank. I, Allie, take you, Frank. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until death do us part. Until death do us part. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And with it pledge. And with it pledge. My loyalty and devotion. My loyalty and devotion. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. All right, Frank, your turn. <laughs> okay, Frank, repeat after me. I, Frank, take you, Allie. I, Frank, <coughs> take you, Allie. To be my wife. To be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Until death do us part. Until death do us part. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. And with it pledge. And with it pledge. My loyalty and devotion. My loyalty and devotion. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Frank, Allie, you might want to grab her hands. I'm about to pronounce you husband and wife. Frank and Allie, now that you have given yourselves to each other by solemn vows, with the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, in the presence of this company and before God, by the authority vested in me as a minister of the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, and by the state of New Jersey, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Those that God has joined together, let no one separate. Frank, you may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure that I now pronounce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Frank Cerami. Somewhere, do you think about traveling and growing old? I 
couple of kids when I was holding your hair back. Now we got our own future, our own stretch of road. The way you dress up on a warm night still gives me the shivers. I will confess you to the starlight when we go down to the river. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our wedding celebration for Allie and Frank. How is everyone feeling out there? Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have a lot of celebrating to do this evening, and I would like to begin by introducing our bride's mother, Robin Kirkwood, accompanied by her son and groomsman, Andy Kirkwood. Next, ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together for the father of our bride, Mr. William Kirkwood. And how about an equally warm round of applause for the groom's parents, Mr. and Mrs. Frank Cerami III. Let's hear from Donna and Frank. Next, ladies and gentlemen, our bridesmaids and groomsmen are coming in as groups. First, let's hear from the ladies, Sarah, Brittany, Bella, and our matron of honor, Nicole. And next, we have our groomsmen. Let's put our hands together for Richie, Pete, and our best man and brother of our groom, Alex. And I would also like to acknowledge the junior members of our bridal party, Steve and Cooper. Unfortunately, they are now napping. But let's hear from Steve and Cooper. They look adorable. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, if everyone could please rise at their place, let's put our hands together. It gives me great pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Frank Sarami IV. Let's hear for Allie and Frank. Well, ladies and gentlemen, our bride and groom are on the dance floor. We're going to have them dance together for the first time as husband and wife. Staring at the ceiling, lost in a ring. Holding out for your love with your ring in my hand Driving through the memories of when I first left Picking up the pieces, hoping we ain't done yet The hurts, the scars, won't define who we are Honey, when we're older, you and I will love all that 
Looking back and seeing everything we've done in every piece Day after day, year after year I'll choose you, I'll never lose you Cause we'll be here Our love grows deep Taking all our chances On you and on me I'll take every season The highs and the lows Even in our hurting You're mine and I'm yours The hurt, the scars Won't define who we are I would like to begin by inviting Pastor Aaron up to say a few words. Let's pray. Father, we are so grateful, and we thank you for family. We thank you for friends. We thank you for Frank and Allie and their lives that we celebrate tonight. We thank you for food. Would we enjoy this night as one of your good gifts to us, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Pastor. I would like to bring the microphone front and center, and I'd like to call upon our groom's father, who is now going to give a welcome speech. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Frank Cerami. Hi, guys. First, I want to say thank you to uh, Pastor Aaron for his wise and heartfelt words. Thank you, Pastor Aaron and uh, his ceremony over there. That was a nice ceremony. How about a nice hand? Well, I want to welcome everyone to Frankie and Allie's wedding. Don and I are thrilled to share this special day with you. I am Frank's dad, also known as Frank. Frankie and Allie, Don and I couldn't be happier and prouder of you both for how you are starting your life together. How you have found serenity in your faith, how you have transformed that house and tabernacle that had good bones into a beautiful sanctuary in the woods after a lot of hard work and investment. You have both grown into a wonderful adult couple and we love you very much both. So here's to your new life together, I don't have a drink, and since you're only 20 minutes away, make sure you let us know if we are dropping in a little too often, because after all, we do want grandchildren. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for Frank Cerami, father of our groom. Next, I would like to invite our maid of honor, Nicole, to join us. My name is Nicole, and I am Allie's maid of honor and close friend. Allie and I initially crossed paths as children in elementary school, but officially met in high school where we did gymnastics and we coached together. Little did we know that God would have our paths continuously cross and we would become the closest of friends. There was a short period of time where we didn't see much of each other, but that quickly changed when we got into the same nursing program and continued to work as nurses in not only one job, but two jobs. Naturally, our friendship grew uh, closer and closer. We spent countless hours studying together and working together, and these were the times that I learned the most about Allie. Anyone who knows Allie knows that she is such a sweet and special person. She has a truly positive impact on everyone that she meets. She's a great listener, and she's an amazing friend. 
One of her, one of her best qualities is her hard work ethic. <laughs> Whether it's at the gym working out or caring for her patients at the hospital, she's always giving 100%. And Frank, well, let's just say he's about as calm, cool, and collected as they come. <laughs> In all seriousness, Frank and Allie, Frank, thank you for making my best friend so happy. It's been a true joy to watch Frank and Allie's relationship grow over the past few years. I've been able to watch up close just how selflessly each one of them gives. They complement each other so well, and I'm so grateful that God has brought the two of you together. So join me in raising your glass for Allie and Frank. May you continue to keep God at the center of your marriage and find joy in every season. Cheers. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for Nicole, beautifully stated. And next, I would like to invite brother of our groom, Mr. Alex Cerami, to take the mic. So, for those of you that don't know me, I'm Alex, his younger brother. Now, weddings are really special. It's when two people come together and proclaim, proclaim that of all the many people out there in the world, this is the best man in the world. <laughs> so thank you, and you guys were right. For a long time, I always thought I was the best, but now I have the official title to go along with it. So thank you guys. <laughs> Allie, you look amazing today, and I am so glad we are becoming one larger family. Frankie, you've been a great brother all my life, and ever since you first met Allie, I knew you guys had something special. I am so glad you guys found each other, and I can't wait to see you guys grow together as a couple. Allie, thanks for being the best thing to ever happen to my brother. You're an incredible person, and I cannot be happier for the two of you. If Frankie is half as good at being a husband as he has been to a brother to me, then you two have a wonderful life to look forward to together. Now let's raise our glasses to Frankie and Allie. Thank you guys, I hope you have a great night. Thank you, Alex. Let's hear for our best man and brother of our groom.
Too many days in the darkness Without a glimpse of the light Running tired and broken and scared But I swear I'll never give up the fight I see you broken and beat Head pulled down over your eyes Every part of you wants to surrender Darling, you were meant to survive With every star We are born again Open your heart Spend this time in your head Just like a seed in a garden